If you have a blog created in WordPress, you can add activities from Aduka Play quickly and easily. To do so, simply click on the activity, click on the Share button found below, and copy the code from the Insert box. Log in to your WordPress dashboard. Go to Posts on the left of the screen and click on Add New. The appearance of the Posts editing screen may vary depending on the version that you're using, but the process to follow is the same. Now add a title and then add a custom HTML block. Here you must insert the code you copied previously from Educa Play and, by clicking on Preview, your activity will load. Now you can publish the post and view it. In this way, you can publish any activity in your blog. That said, you may want to record the results of users of your blog who complete activities. As you know, in order to record results of activities in Educa Play, these users must be logged in. But, when opening the activity from an external site, it would be inconvenient for users to have to go to Educa Play to log in. Luckily, there's an easy solution. Go back to your Educa Play profile and select Edit for the relevant activity. You can see the option Run Mode, which, if you set as Anonymous Execution Mode Not Allowed, will prevent users from opening the activity without previously having logged in to Educa Play. Click on Send and log out from your Educa Play profile. Now go back to your blog and refresh the page. You'll see that you are now required to log in before starting the activity. In this way, users will be able to log in directly from your blog with their results being saved. Once users have logged in, they'll be able to start the activity and will remain logged in as long as the session remains active. You will be able to see users' results in the usual activities reports. Remember that changing the run mode option is only available to premium users. If you still don't have a premium account, sign up now by clicking on the premium tab in Educa Play.